Hey everyone, so I just wanted to do a video on Landshare Intentional Community. And the basic idea is that, um, say for instance you have a vacant land that is $100,000, and uh, you have to pay 20% down in order to get a decent mortgage. So that's $20,000 uh, down payment. Now, not everyone has that, uh, especially uh, millennials who may not be as fortunate. Um, and so you can actually have a cooperative. Uh, say, for instance, you have an eight acre uh, plot, and then you, a, a, each person needs about half an acre in order to uh, have enough food to sustain themselves. So uh, you give it each person half an acre, uh, and then you have a cooperative of 16 people come together and um, can bring down... The, the, there's some additional costs to uh, getting a property, like there's legal fees and um, things like that. And so you could then get the property for about like $2,000 down, and uh, including the mortgage and the property tax, uh, probably about $75 a month. And for a lot of people, uh, that is much more affordable uh, than what you might be paying for rent now. Like in Ontario, it's usually uh, uh, bottom dollar is like $500 a month for a small uh, shared room or something like this. Uh, so $75 a month, a half an acre is pretty good. Now, um, because this is would usually be an agricultural land, uh, you wouldn't have the ability to have a permanent residence there. However, you could have a residence there so long as you're working the land, and uh, because then you're a farmhand or helping with farming, and so 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 that should be how it works. And I'm going to be posting some more videos as uh, we're getting more of this together. And currently, we, we have an effort in Owen Sound, Ontario, uh, which is uh, on the Georgian Bay. Uh, and we're working with a glassworks cooperative, which has, uh, between it and its parent cooperative, uh, about 120 members who may be interested. And so hopefully we can get 16 people to collaborate on this. Um, and we'll be making videos of interacting with the uh, planning people and the zoning people. And it will be kind of like a documentary to help you in your own place do the same thing. Because we're, we're, we're going at it this from an approach of forgiveness and compassion. And uh, that really we're all going to the same place of uh, intentional communities. And we all want people to have a good life. And the United Nations says that if people do not have land that they can use to grow their own food. And that is a state of absolute poverty. So... In that sense, you could even consider your cooperative to be a charitable cooperative in terms of alleviation of poverty. Uh, now, whether that definition of poverty is the same as whatever is considered in your jurisdiction uh, may differ, uh, but uh, if that international uh, statement holds, uh, then it could work. Anyway, so that's all for now, and uh, ho hope you have a good time.